Oh my god! <laughs> oh, there we go. Um, welcome to Planet Zoo. Uh, just quick my avatar. I wonder if they put like new outfits and stuff into this. They probably have. I'm a male. Got to be a male. And. I don't know, I would, uh, my old Planet Coaster character is a teen, but I don't know, I might as well go for adult this time because, yeah. I'm gonna... There we go. Uh, hats. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> mm. oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm having that. I'm having that. Yeah. There we go, that's my character. Uh, got a potion just where I, just about where I am. Some of our beautiful oh, you know, animals. Uh, would it be somewhere over we'll here? We'll start by popping over and having no, a look-see anything. at the grizzly bears in their habitat. But where are they? Where are the grizzly bears? Where are they? There's the lines again. Yeah, I went back to the lines. Well, I just noticed. Oh, is that like a little bed, you know, a bit where they can lay? I suppose so. Uh, where are they? Right, the lemurs are in there. Sure. I don't know, uh, look for the fences. Where are they? Like, seriously, where are they? Oh, over here? What's here? What lives here? Some rotten meat in. Hello? Hello? No, no. Is there any... Oh. Uh, what are they call snow lippers, aren't they? Because they're whitish. Mm. Oh, is this it? No. Nope, zebras. Okay, found some zebras. Uh... Aha! <laughs> Did you know that grizzly bears, I found you. also known as Ursus arctos horribilis, can hibernate for up to seven months a year? Uh, <laughs> oh, but then again... Given the chance, I think a lot of people would do that too. <laughs> hmm. I know I would. If I didn't do YouTube. <laughs> Select one of the bears and you'll bring up its information panel. Okay. Right. Select the bear. Yeah. This bear is where you can find out all kinds of information oh, God, about your animal. <laughs> the most important thing being its overall welfare. Richmond, what's your Richmond? I guess, uh, to oh, you wouldn't like toys, okay. You'll learn more about animal welfare today as we go through your objectives. But for now, let's enjoy this magnificent animal. Why don't you select the camera at the bottom of its information panel? Okay, and uh, also, why is there smoke in this place? Oh, I get to... Oh, now this is like um... a... <coughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry, I've raided this private space. I've raided this private space. Stay away from him. Okay, when you're ready, let's pop over to the other side of the zoo and take a look at the lions. I've oh, marked the location for you to find. Oh, but I uh, do you know where they are. Did, <laughs> so you made me go find that one, but when I found this one, oh no, I help you. Man, this woman's a tiny bit evil. Wasting my time. Anyway, yeah, don't. Oh, it's a little baby one. Oh. Anthera Leo Leo, all the West <laughs> the to you and me. Uh. The lions are the most social of the big cats, and there can be as many as 40 really? lions in a pride, although prides of that size are pretty rare. Shame, shame that this video has to be all as low Bernie frame rate. Say, I'm sorry about that, awesome. I really am. I may recall <laughs> Which this is precisely again. why I handle the training instead these days. <laughs> anyway, how about we get started on those objectives? Come on, let's head over to our warthog habitat and see what needs doing there. Okay, the empty one. That one? Okay. Glossing? Did I hear glossing? There we are, a yeah, pair of okay. perfectly splendid warthogs for our zoo. Just click on them and select buy from the side menu. I already did that. Normally the animal exchange would be I full of animals, did but did I've that. emptied out the market while you learn how it works. So you want the me last to go thing here? I need is you yeah. accidentally ordering a dozen elephants. 
<laughs> oh, I want to have fun. Let me have fun. Let me put dozens of elephants roaming around the whole body zoo. All right. So let's go and watch the uh, takers in action. Uh, I just noticed something. Oh, oh, the heads. Oh, oh, the further they get away, the heads just disappear. Oh, the heads are over there. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> If you if you like pay attention to their heads, right? Uh, pay pay attention pay attention to that one, right? I'm gonna highlight it. As we get you see the head just disappears. <laughs> oh okay. Fine. Hmm. Oh and the angle snap is off and it's still not free. Look, it's still like snapping in places. Mm, okay, the I would say that the walls are not that freedom. You don't have that much freedom with the walls. But um, oh well. Oh good. Yeah. Oh god, you can do it. How long? Okay, pretty long. You can have it up to twenty meters. Let's just go with six and then turn. Yeah, and then we'll connect it up. Except for this is going to be a bit difficult with it not being freedom. Good work. Remember, before oh, you can that's place a animals bad. in any that's habitat, bad. it has to have a full loop of connected barrier. Yeah. Now you've probably noticed that guests can't actually see into this habitat at the moment. Yeah. At least not without a step ladder. But seeing as they're banned, I'd like you to select a piece of barrier and swap out the brick for a glass barrier so the guests can see it. Oh, you gotta be. Why did you make me do that then? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, there is definitely no destruction tool. Well, I don't seem to see it, but yeah, if you right click on it, it does it. Okay, well, we'll put it. God damn it, let's. Up, up the thing. Well, I did select. I, I selected it. Okay, the train going by. Select. God damn it. The thing won't. There we go. Adding in more windows gives guests even more opportunities to see the animals in a habitat. It's always best to make sure the guests can get a good view into a habitat from the path they're walking on. Because yeah. it makes them happy. And because this would be a pretty terrible zoo if they couldn't. Well, that's what the slow feeder will do. If it, uh, I'm feeling a little bit like uh, some things are limited. It's like, I, I want the bowl like there, <laughs> at least. Not too away from the wall and all that stuff. You know, to make it all nice and tidy and everything and nice looking. Yeah, our first time! Oh, good to see the ostriches have somewhere they can really stretch their legs. Did you know they can actually run at 43 miles per hour? Is it going to do that a lot? Oh, heaven forbid you, they ever escape. <laughs> the speed about. camera finds a low with bankruptcies. <laughs> Yeah, I think I think it's gonna keep telling you about the animals and all that stuff as you go along in the career. How? Oh God! Watch, watch your face! Watch your face! It's pretty. Oh God! Sorry, guys. Bernie oh, sorry. Seems impressed. <laughs> Did he do his speed camera joke? Every yes. time we <laughs> get an ostrich to turn the heat map off. Bottom, bottom left, bottom left, down here. You mean? Right. No. 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 Still can't place it. No. It's probably because it already has power. Well. Well, I am recording this on day one. You know, it's it just came out like ten minutes ago. <laughs> and. Uh, yeah, uh, 
it seems like this doesn't work. <laughs> oh well, it is a beta after all. It's gonna have some issues. But it's a, sh it's a shame. You know, what if I can place it really fast? Right. Right, and go. No? No. Ah, oh, well, you can see that. Yeah, if it's not getting powered, then yeah, <laughs> it's not even in the. Ah, I see. But still, I can't seem to place it. I'm gonna hold it down. Nope. Well, what can I... Ah! Ah! Ah, alright, oh, I see what I've been doing wrong. Okay, now it will place with it. Lovely yes. work. Alright. Now the keepers can start using the hat to prepare Fun. food. And thanks to where you put it, they will it need to walk very path. far to deliver it to the ostriches and hippos. I didn't think it would have a path with it. Let's get on to your next oh, no. objective then. Bengal tigers. We want mm. to adopt some, but I'm afraid there's nothing ready for them yet. Head on over to the plot of land I've marked out. It's not too far away. Yeah, th this, th this, this is making <laughs> making the train this little standby noise that I know. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, uh, we've got to get, like, tiger tools. Righty, your next job is to build a habitat. Oh, yeah, there From is no scratch. walls at all. And wood and concrete, I expect. <laughs> so, go ahead and build oh, it. And don't forget it. the habitat gate. Alright, alright. Don't have to give me that uh, kind of attitude, innit? There we go. Done. Oh, wait, not done. Uh, need... Apparently they, they want us to put it over here, so that's what we do. I'll put it... Now, Bernie takes safety very seriously at his zoos, yeah. so we should probably make sure those tigers can't jump out of their habitat, don't you think? <laughs> the way we'll do it is by changing the height of the habitat's barrier. Uh. Right, <laughs> but I just did all that. Is there a way to do okay, it? Okay then, you should start by double clicking the habitat barrier, which will take you into barrier editing mode. Right. <laughs> Great, now highlight the entire perimeter of the habitat. You can do that by clicking and dragging the barrier selection tool. We mean this, basically like the planet zoo, I mean planet coaster. Now you've got all of the about. perimeter selected, you can <laughs> increase I? the height yeah, of okay. it by clicking and dragging the barrier height tool upwards. You'll want to make sure it reaches a minimum height of four meters. Which oh what? Okay, and then this That's only doing that only did one. <laughs> I think it was bugged. I think, I think it was bugged there. Right, yeah, in that bit. Ah, there we go. Um, I'm going to have to lower that down. Okay, that's the habitat boundary complete, oh, the habitat gate in this. place, and most importantly, the tigers won't be able to jump out of it anymore. Uh, definitely not going to jump out of that bit of the wall. <laughs> those tigers. Hold on. To... Can I not change this now? Oh no. Oh no, it has to stay like that. Okay, that would be the weird one wall that if we had a picture like, you know, like a tiger picture at the back. Okay, we just paint it over, okay? <laughs> Yeah, the game won't let me now. Ah, ah, no. Oh yeah, I should have, I should have thought that would be in the game. Oh, ah, fucking hell. <laughs> no, no, no spiders. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, there'll be no spiders in my, my zoo. No spiders are banned. 
Oh, there's Fluffy Chop. Yeah, Fluffy Chop. Oh my god, he looks so cute. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> I want, I want, I want a Fluffy Chop. Go away. If I ever do get fully stuck. Blood? Frozen blood punky? Wait, is this, is that, is that a toy? I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> I, I don't think it's a good idea. Uh, I keep thinking it's uh, I don't know, I'm thinking of another game where you right click and drag and then it turns it around. Or is it Planet Coaster? Maybe it is. Uh, I don't know, put that. Uh. Right. Did it. <laughs> uh, yeah, food, food, food. Oh, you have to, you have to have the blood. Oh, you got, you have to have the blood. Okay, enjoy your blood. <laughs> All right. No, I'll put it. I'll put it. Put over, over here. No, no one wants. The visitors okay, don't need to see really starting blood. to take shape. That would scare some people. Nah. They say the good fences make good neighbors. I guess okay. that's doubly true when one of the neighbors is a Bengal tiger. <laughs> Still, those tigers look so happy that I doubt they'd leave. No, they took Even away if you did poke a the hole in their fence. <laughs> okay, that's the social tab. Adult population. You want adults in your place? <laughs> Uh, uh, as a teen, uh, you know, I've been, of course I've been a teenager and I know what it's like, you, you just want to be left alone, you don't want adults around you, you just want your own space, <laughs> you know, how are you gonna, how are you gonna find coffin stuff, this, this is not good for you. You can lower their stress levels by swapping out the normal glass barriers for one-way glass. It's not a cheap option, but I think they're worth the expense, don't you? This will give the snow leopard somewhere to go when they want to get away but from the prying eyes of the guests. He's not stressed. I know. I get animal, animal is calm. See, he's not stressed. He's fine. We don't need to do that then. <laughs> oh, fine. Fucking. Why is that highlighting over there? Oh, oh, okay. It wants, uh, it wants me to do this one. How do you know it's the right way? Of course, when an animal isn't in its natural biome, it's probably going to be too hot or too cold. And surprisingly, oh no. for the snow I've done it the wrong way round. It's too hot. I think. Even with the terrible know. British weather, you should help cool it down by adding some to the habitat. But let's start by opening up the temperature heat map and having a look see at the temperature in the leopard's habitat. I don't think anyone wants to know when they're going to die, do they? This is just going, hey, hey Snow Leopard, you're going to die here. This is when you die, right right, right when you reach this point. That's when you die. <laughs> He's going to be fucking terrible. He's going to be more stressed than, well, the tutorial thinks he is. He's going to be more stressed than he He's going to be, he's going to have PTSD, isn't he? <laughs> right, um, oh my god, what the fuck is that? <laughs> okay, it's like a wooden sculpture version of it, okay. Okay, fine. <laughs> you've, you've got like some weird clones up there, you know? Oh, you just eat all the food or... Basically, the game's pretty alright. I recommend you buy it. Uh, go buy the deluxe version. You get like um, a few special animals that you can't get in the standard version. And, you know, if you buy the deluxe now, you know, you get to play it. You get to play the beta, like what you just saw here. This is the beta. And this is almost kind of all of it is. Um, once you get three stars, that's apparently it. Because that's the career mode. You only get one career mode right now. Um, you don't, you, you can't do sandbox. You don't get more career maps you can do. It's just this one, just this level. Uh, you can repeat it many times as you want, of course. But of course, once I finish it, I'm going to probably play it one more time. And that will be it. Because, yeah, why, why, why would I want to keep doing it? over and over again I, I, when I heard the news I was like I'm a bit disappointed but I already I bought it like like I don't know like a month ago or two when the news came out about the beta is going to be a bit strict you know it's going to be like oh this is going to be that but 
I'm still pretty happy with the result and yeah um, I can't I need to definitely improve my computer because if, if I can't run this game then clearly new games that may come out in 20 in 2020 um, I'm not going to be able to record all thingy so I need to upgrade my computer just so I could be able to record these at better frames but yeah um, I really like the game um, I recommend that you go buy the game, either the standard or the deluxe version. I would kind of recommend the deluxe because, you know, this is beautiful. It's nice. I like it. And he's just going to stay in there. Come on, I did like a cin cinematic, you know, camera for you and you're just going to stand there. <laughs> he's, he's broke. <laughs> he's like, oh, I don't know what to do. I'm wet, but should I go to land? But if I go on land, there's not much room for me to get on land. I'm just going to shit here. Um, thinking that there should be, like, fishes here. There should be, like, fishes in the water for me. Um, stuff like that. So, thank you for watching. Hope to see you in whatever episode it may be. And go to my... Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Um, and go to my Discord server. And, oh, with the YouTube, don't forget to hit that bell. And yeah, let me know what you think of this game. And like I said, I'm sorry about the frames for a second, pretty low. Uh, I really need to upgrade my computer. It's starting to get out of date <laughs> by all these new games coming out. It's like, oh, it needs an upgrade. It really does. But um, yeah, thank you for watching and goodbye.